Another episode of Steezo Radio. Uh, I'm trying to think, should I do topic or intros first? Because this is going to be very entertaining. <laughs> I'm going to do intros first. What's going on? It's Residential Young and Kurt. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at underscore Kurt SR and Snapchat SR underscore Kurt. It's that nigga back at the round table. And that's nigga with an A, not, not an E-R. E-R. <laughs> you already know Short in the building. Follow me at underscore Short Gotem. That's G-O-T-E-M. And we got a special guest in the building. He a friend of a lot of us. We just call him Young Sir. Right. Introduce yourself, man. <laughs> I'm Young Sir. How y'all doing out there? <laughs> <laughs> All right. This topic is, can men and women be friends and just friends? Now, before we start, we had a pre-show. <laughs> the pre-show was very entertaining. A lot of quality shit could have been on the show. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, it should have. Who's going to make the cut? <laughs> <laughs> now, every every question has rules and exceptions. But I'm going to ask right now, Youngin, in your situation, can you be friends with the opposite sex? I could, but I will always think about fucking them. Why is that? Cause I'm a man. Now I, I, I just think naturally, I would want to be friends with somebody I might want to fuck. Now are you saying that if you meet them now or growing up as yeah. a friend? Even if I met them now, <laughs> uh, you know, like hey. so growing up with them, you still like y'all been cool since seven. Well, uh, no, nah, it's a couple of them that let themselves go over the, over the years. <laughs> so, uh. I mean, I, I know some that I've grown up with that, yeah. But back then, you would have fucked. Back then, I would have yeah. At seven. At seven. <laughs> you just nasty. You just nasty. <laughs> so, he, so, he, so you became friends with them now by default, really. By default. <laughs> it wasn't your choice. It was by default. I hear you. What about you, that nigga? The... Nah, man. I mean, I always envy the people who could do it, who say, man, she's just a female friend of mine, blah, blah, blah. I just normally I got a history with them if she if she a friend or you know I couldn't if if I it wasn't by choice man I just I I, I don't know if it could be, just be a friend I I really mm. don't know unless unless she ugly I mean if she's unattractive she could be my friend unattractive to you, you know as far saying? as your standards yeah you know I'd be that. like nah you know, she's just cool but then it's like. My lady wouldn't even have to worry about that because I'd be like, did you see the bitch? You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> no, you know I ain't fucking with her. Well, you know females just think, well, she probably ugly to you, but she can still right. suck you off. Yeah. Well, yeah, okay. Do well, you, no, I guess I can't have a female. <laughs> <laughs> How about you, Short? Can you, uh, do you think men and women can be just friends? I'm going to disagree with them two on this one. Say, yeah. Mm. Why? That's I've coming been, from Short. I, I've been, <laughs> yeah. Short I've been doing it for like six years now. Friends with female best friend, and I've never thought of her that type of way. Is she attractive? Like she is. Okay. She is attractive. Mm. Mm. She is attractive. <laughs> <laughs> Young and giggling hard, ain't it? What's she up, is. girl? <laughs> <laughs> she is very attractive, but it's just it's always been that friendship type of level with her. I've never thought of it as anything. How did that come about? Come about though, like when you first met her, like how did that come about? 
the school. So it was just, I mean, so you Is never history? had. Yeah. Hmm. You think? Not, and not a sexual history. Like, I, I've never thought of it that way. She just always, you know what I'm saying? She, she like, just she, always, she cool, always like been there like as a the friend. Guys. Yeah. Yeah, she's like one of the guys, for real. So if one of the guys smashed and came back saying it was good, you still look the same way? I've actually had <laughs> Two of three of the guys oh, do three? that. Damn. Damn. I still don't want to. Your best that. friend a runner? <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Look, I'm not judging on what she I am. I don't know. I'm talking book now. As a friend, you know what I'm saying? She right. there for me. As a friend. When I need a friend, she that friend I can go to. She one of them. Shit, on she, the female side. She a friend from some of your you other buddies. You better like Shit. this too. <laughs> when I want, you What's know, when I'm trying that? to figure out why my woman acting a certain way or something like that, uh -huh. she could probably give me information on that. So you say your female friend is your cheat sheet for your girl? In a way, yeah. Okay. What you got, young sir? Well, I say no. I, me, I couldn't do it, but I think. Yeah, it's some circus. Some horn dog. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. That is true. As I shake my head up and down. I just look at it as though you don't, you get thrown into being in the friend zone. Okay. As far as you placing yourself there, so it's pretty much a a, circumstance, a situational thing for me. Mm -hmm. That's how I look at it. I agree with you on that. Now, so, see, now me personally, because I have I have female friends, and like I said, we. We've been friends for like decades. You know what I'm saying? Some I grew up with, some like family, you know, some you know my mama, they knew grandma before she passed. So it's kind of like you, I never had a chance to look at them like that. You know what I'm saying? Cause I was trying to get what they, get with they friends. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I can admit that I can't make new female friends. Right. You see what I'm saying? Cause my shit is history. You know, it's like, you kind of been right. through too much. You know what I'm saying? You know too much. And you know something? I think the only way I could personally do it would be somebody that we had the history, but now we're not on that no more. Now, she can be a friend. You know what I'm saying? But just somebody that I've never touched before. I, I've never <laughs> met anybody like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But I would like to. <laughs> Unfortunately, I haven't. But I could have messed with you at a point in time, and then we can hang out and it just be that. Well, let me give y'all a scenario. I could do that. Let me let me give y'all a scenario. Because, you know, I, I got a little cousin who y'all know, like my little sister. And, you know, her friends, because, of you know, they were her friends, I treat them like my little sisters. You know what I'm saying? Now, at the same time, she had some where it was like, <laughs> we ain't relate. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, but the others, you know what I'm saying? The others was kind of like they, they were more in, you know, in the family. You know what I'm saying? Right. right. Like you see them at every, every damn function. You couldn't avoid them if you wanted to. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it was kind of like you just couldn't. I I, I couldn't find them cute. So kind of like 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 um, my man was just saying, it wasn't. It was like you was somewhat put in the friend zone. Yeah. But you was forced in a way. But yeah. She just didn't do it. It was just like you like always right. did. Like yeah. Situational. So yeah. That's what I'm saying. Right. And and to me, I think I'm not saying that's the only way you can be. Because I know military people, you know, who, man, they, you know, they was they, they tell you them stories that you may not want to hear about the military, and you understand why they friends, you know what I'm saying? But I just don't think that now. You know, at my age, meeting somebody new, and then saying we're just friends, that's because she probably got something that's going to kill her. Or maybe, you know, that, or maybe I need that. You know what I'm saying? Maybe, you know, I met a female and she was just so open to the fact of the shit she's done and it made me like cringe get me the screw face like what the yeah, fuck yeah. and then I'm like yeah you cool people but I don't even fuck with you like that but I guess you gotta find that female who's just so open with you Right. but that I think that's only gonna come from a female that look at you like I don't wanna fuck with you anyway Nick and that's probably like, best if they lesbian I, I well, like I got you friends who lesbians you know you say what you say you what short fuck with me hey you say it again that you, yeah, but you know, you, you know, guys hard headed. You don't want to fuck me today, but right. you know, yeah, right. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Wait till I get this haircut. Right, hold the real. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's kind of how I look. All I gotta do is go out with you one time. I got you. Mm -hmm. That's all. Now, another question on the same topic. Do you allow, or are you cool with your girl having male friends? I'm cool with it, but 
in reality because I don't think I can have it. Mm -hmm. I don't think he can have it. So I mean, in reality, you, I can understand it, but I, I all I all I say is I say this. I think females should do it for guys, and I think guys should do it for females. You got to put your significant other on game. So my thing is, yeah, you can have a male friend, but don't be blind to the fact when shit, when he say certain shit or he right. do certain shit, and you like, oh, he's just doing that as a friend. No. Don't be blind yeah. to the game. So yeah. I just say you got to put your lady on the game, and I think that's your responsibility to put your lady on the game, and I think it's her responsibility to put you on the game because I kid you not. I do not know unless she bluntly do it. I do not know if my is flirting with me. Steezo slow clap. Steezo slow clap. I do not fucking know. Man. And you would be in the chick. I've been in situations and the chick would be like, you know, she was just flirting with you. Yep. I'm like, I did not fucking see it. Yep. You and know I, what I'm saying? I've unless she bluntly felt, do it, I do not fucking see it. I've always Boy, felt. Join them. <laughs> that, right, unless you know she like she like what's your name and she rubbing her titties. I'm like, you young know, and you right. and even then I'm like yes. maybe she just drunk. Hey, yeah, if she don't pull a titty out saying suck it, I <laughs> I don't know. And you know I, I think it's know. because females been get hit on since puberty forever. We get hit on you know later on. You know what I'm saying? 16, 17. They be 10, 11 getting used to shorty. So we yeah, I think some of us are a little slow. To what females I can do. agree on that Yeah, I can yeah. agree on, I can I agree on that A little bit slow yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, do not yeah. fucking know Like I tell my female In a minute Hey baby Look If you saw something Let me know You know what I'm saying Cause, yeah, cause I, I'm not trying to be dumb But I can't tell I think she don't want to let me know Cause she think I might Make a move on <laughs> so, I understand But 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 no I, I mean I just don't know And That's why I say It's very important For I think the female To put a guy on game She's nah. like, look, man, if a female doing this to you, you need to know this is what she on. Now, let, let, let me ask y'all another one. It's, this is still on topic. For 2016, we're going to be more on topic, if we feel like it. Right. Uh, how do y'all feel about the whole work-related relationships? You know, the whole you, you work, the work husband. husband. Yeah, work, work husband, wife. work wife shit. Fuck that shit. It's a problem. Why? It, it, it's a problem because, I mean, you could be at work and not even... Thinking about anyone, okay. And, and sometimes women or men, they look at it as though, oh, well, why? The, if they, if a person asks you a question, why are they asking you this? Because it's more, it's sometimes just like an insecure. If they insecure about themselves, they feel like any, anybody wants to come and talk to you, right. and you, you don't even mm. think about that person exactly. at all. But just because they ask you a question. It's all of a sudden, oh, you want to talk to them or they want to talk to you. And I think we as men, we get that more from women than they get it from us. Yeah, we do. And I think it goes back because we slow. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, for real. Yeah, I mean, think about yeah, it. Yeah, I agree with that. Because I done been in some situations like that and I'd be like, what the fuck you talking about? Exactly. Like, right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? She asked me if I could pass her for yeah. I don't Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think no, we slow. I it, 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 it's a whole bunch of issues with that. I mean, you could just be doing like, you know, she's a woman or uh, let me help you with that. Oh, why you help me with that? Yeah. Like, it could be your job. Like, 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 no. Okay then, so you try to fuck. Ex so yeah. let's yeah. 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 right so let me, yeah. you know what I mean. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. So I, I mean, I mean, I, I think, I think females, and I, I'm assuming females may think of that. Oh, you know, I got a work husband, meaning that he go out and give me lunch. It's cause, cause I'm over, cause I'm overwhelmed with work, so maybe he'll go out and give me lunch. Yeah, but how do you feel about the lunch thing, that nigga? I mean, they go to lunch. Three to five times a week. No. Again, I think you just gotta put your you gotta put your lady on game. Yeah. You gotta be like, okay, I mean, I mean, well, you gotta say my thing is, I don't, I don't understand. I, I understand, you know, you want to go out, you go out to lunch with a coworker. He's a guy. Okay, cool, I get it. My problem is, don't be blind to the fact of what that he's up you to. don't see what he's up to. You know, then you be like, you know, I come to you and I'm like, hey man, blah blah blah. You sitting there like, huh? <laughs> I don't see that happening. Right. You know what I mean? 
Now, now, like, like you said earlier, you know, I know a lot of females listen to that, but that's the same thing about, you know, you passing on the fork. You know she's seeing that. That's some simple shit. I'm talking about he went out, bought your lunch, this, that, and the third. You know, so yeah. I just say just put your lady on the game, she puts you on the game, and you go from there. Okay, now let me ask you this. Would you rather put her up on game? Okay, they going out to lunch three, four times out the week, right? Right. You feel some type of way about that, clearly. So instead of putting her up on game, how about one of those days out them three, four times a week, they going to lunch? You step in and be like, babe, today I'm taking you to lunch. How about that? I mean, you, you can well, you, do you, that, you, but yeah, it, still don't, it still don't kill <laughs> the fact that when you're not there tomorrow, she going to lunch with dude. And plus, well, you probably and plus and plus you probably just doing that to piss around the territory. You just pissing on your territory because you want the nigga to know, hey, I'm back here. the fuck up. Right. Think about it. Because you, know you, you, you just came for that's one pride, day, baby boy. <laughs> came for one day. They right. work five days a week. You just went out there. You want you you hope she introduced you to it. You probably were like, so you ain't gonna introduce me to the nigga that was taking you to lunch. <laughs> <laughs> now you mad, right? That's you ain't gonna introduce, uh-huh. you introduce me to the dude, and I came down there. But you introduced me to your friend, though, huh? You know something? Right. Then you got that issue going on. So, I mean, <laughs> I mean, I I haven't, but I understand it. Like my thing is this: when you with, I guess with the work related thing, you know what I'm saying? I always felt if you're not cool with me doing it, yeah. then you shouldn't do it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's how I, that, I mean, I'm for real. But you know how women are. Double standards, right? What you mean? Yeah. That, like he said, double standards. But what's the double standard on that? If you're not cool with me doing it, don't do it. Oh, the one, the one, the one. That's you, mutual but you know, women on both ends. You know, women, they, they, they walk that tightrope. Well, you, you, know, you know what I'm saying? Well, he not my work husband. He just in the cubicle next to me. No, and he I, my I, lunch I think, I think the woman's okay. going to say this in that situation if you're doing it. But I'm not trying to fuck him. She's going to think you're trying to fuck your work wife. Because you, you're going to hear that. You're going to hear yeah. that. Double yeah. What you talking yeah. about? Why I can't do it? Oh, because you're trying to fuck her. Yep. He ain't trying to fuck me. And, and, and if he do yeah. try to fuck me, I know how to say no. Double standard. Yeah, you do right. Cause it seems like <laughs> See, it, it, they have more power. But, but my issue with that, though, <laughs> women are a lot naive when, when they come to shit like that. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, because that, I, I think that so goes too. back to what you're saying about putting on game. The whole time, work husband is trying to fuck. Because it go from lunch to, oh, we off. And I, you know, you're going to be at the Christmas party. And I got one rule. If I put you on something, if I give you information about something, you are not. You are now responsible for it. If yeah. I didn't tell you, you know, you want respons- You don't know. You can't blame somebody if they don't know. But once I put you up on game and you still fall for it, you are now responsible for that. So now you yeah. got to deal with the consequences. Well, okay. Well, what about this? Let's say, you know, I'm trying to be fair. Let's say you tell your lady, hey, you know, I don't like what this motherfucker on. But she telling you, no, nah, babe, ain't nothing to worry about. Da, 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 da. Do you feel that if a man or a woman tells the, their significant other, I don't like what's going on, it should stop right there? Because if yeah. it continues, isn't it a problem? Uh, I think you're going to run into a problem either way. Because if you stop it... Then you may be saying in your mind, am I dealing with someone insecure? And if you just sit up there and you don't stop it, if she doesn't stop it, it's going to run into the issue where she like, you, don't you know, care. you don't care. Exactly. Yeah, so, so I, I don't, know. I don't, that, 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 and that's my question. Is it insecurity? Or it, <sighs> because like, like you said, you a guy. You kind of get what he's on. You know, she's a woman. She get what she's on. When I come home saying, oh, I ain't hungry. Such and such brought me a, a big a big lunch. Let that shit happen three times a week. And she, why is she bringing you these big lunches? You know what I'm saying? And you saying, oh, baby, it ain't nothing like that. She got a husband. No, why is she bringing you? It's 55 of y'all working in this <laughs> office. And so she why bring is she lunch bring, for every nigga. Right, why is she bringing you the big lunch? And then wow. she say, hey, you know what, Stizo, I, I don't like that. I think she's up to something. So now I say, all right, I'm respect that. You know what I'm saying? If I turn around and say you insecure, you feel what I'm saying? Can I really say she's being insecure? Or is she trying to put me up on game? The way we keep saying we're trying to put our lady up 
on game. Well, I guess that, that comes with an explanation. And, and, she has to come with an explanation. I mean, Why does she think that? I look at it like this. It depends on she the lunch lady. what your your relationship <laughs> with that person is like. You know, if y'all right. in a good relationship with each other, that's what. Let, let, let's say it's great. Let's say it's you know it's, it's remarkable at home. You know, it ain't you know because a lot of times when it's bad, you can't. But then, but then once again, if she, what if she, if she's with you for a long period of time, she knows how you are. You could be that flirt. Flirt. Flirtatious type person. Yeah, I've been guilty. Of so me and that nigga know, is going to go to you, rehab, flirt rehab. And, and that but but I'm just saying oh, that no, that no, might no. be as far as it might go. <laughs> huh? That I mean, that's as far as you know. It, it goes with you. You could be, you know, you're not. You don't know you're flirting, but that's just the way that you are. And she sees that, and she comes at you with that. I mean, <laughs> it's one of those. She's telling you that because she know how you are, and she don't want to go no further. Can you respect that? Or is she? But uh, if that's how I got you, then it shouldn't matter. But it. But then you, but then you, you walk in that. Right, you're right, you're right, you're right, right, exactly. That's yeah, what I'm like. Nine times out of ten, if I'm <laughs> not knowingly flirting with you, but we end up together, and that's what I'm doing. Oh, never mind. Yeah, right, right, right. Well, it could be an insecurity because, in a sense, because like, yeah, you fucked yourself. But I'm giving I'm gonna get my man out of it. But um, short got him. Right. You know what I'm <laughs> like I have a habit of I would call <laughs> I have a habit of using the word sweetheart. And I say it to strangers. And I just say sweetheart. And I've heard so, you say that when you pissed. And yeah. Like he finna cuss a female right. out, he'll start out with sweetheart. Sweetheart. That was me off. Right. You know what I'm saying? So I have a habit of saying that. So I guess you know, if I say it to a female and my lady is there and I say it to a female and she say, are you flirting with her in front of her? I yeah. guess it's up to my female to understand this is just what he say. Yeah. But I, you know what I think it has a lot to do? It's the chick that I'm saying, sweetheart to, is she attractive? Then, you know, yeah, then it's like, like, oh, you yeah. flirting with the bitch? Yeah. But if she was ugly, she'd be like, how are you doing? She'd shake her head. Right. Yeah, she'd feel like you so made her day. Is that so an insecurity it thing? It gotta be. That could be an insecurity thing. But it, it's, 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 it sounds more like a threatening thing than insecurity. Cause, I don't know. Because you just said yeah. that if she's ugly, she don't care. But if oh, she's attractive... <laughs> but if she's attractive, it's more like, the fuck you call her well, sweetheart? Right. right. And you'd be like, I've said that plenty of times. But... Yeah. I, I, I don't know, man. Fuck it. They all crazy. I, that's all I can say, man. I don't care. <laughs> like, like, they all fucking crazy, crazy man. You know. I've learned the hard way that what men see as being wrong in a relationship, you got to kind of, I guess, tiptoe the line on the woman's side. Because, let me give you a prime example. Facebook. A man put a selfie up. He gonna get a couple of likes. <laughs> I, and when I say, I mean, you know, this a girl fe- gonna like it. Yeah, a, fe- a female like put it. a selfie up. She gets a thousand likes and a bunch of thirsty comments. Damn Same geez. scenario. A man puts a, I mean, this is the female. She puts a picture up of her and her guy. Right. She probably get eight, eight likes. likes. Mm. Three. She got five thousand friends though. Yeah, she, <laughs> she get, get eight likes. likes. And out of the eight likes, seven of them go relatives, be, <laughs> right? Relatives and 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 females, mm-hmm. but vice versa. A guy put a picture up of him and his girl, he's gonna get thirty five to forty likes out of two hundred friends because it seems like society loves to see a guy right. being good with his woman versus a woman being good with his guy because it's like, damn, she happy, I can't fuck. <laughs> I mean, think about it. Think about it. Because when a female put a status up, like I've seen females put stats up where they say, "This some bullshit. I'm tired of this," and they inbox will blow the fuck up. And first Just thing in case, say, yeah, yo, guy. Now you it could be work. You, it could be the car. You okay, sweetheart? <laughs> Wait, that, I don't say that. I mean, I say sweetheart. See, that shit just happy. Make it better but, for you. Yeah, you right. see what I'm saying? They be thirsty. <laughs> right. Now that's all she said. I'm tired of this. This some bullshit. 
That's it. Don't let that get to you, sweetheart. You know, that, that, right. that, 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 let God let God take care of what you got. <laughs> <laughs> I seen all that dumb shit, man. I seen all that dumb yeah, shit, man. Yeah. You know what I mean? And that's another thing, too. You too beautiful for that, baby. You don't let nobody steal your right. joy. Man, shut the fuck up, man. God. Oh, thank you. Because guys will bring the Lord in to get the God. Man, I hear that shit. Yeah. <laughs> we will quote the Bible. Man, that shit used to irritate the hell out of me on that bullshit. Yeah, they will bring it. You know, that God, same thing with puss ass, uh-huh. puss ass niggas. They used to be like, you know, this all shut out all the single women out there. You strong, beautiful black woman. Shut the fuck up, man. Right? <laughs> Good morning, all my beautiful. Man, that shit used to piss me off. <laughs> yes, thank you. I needed to hit off. Shut the fuck up, both of y'all. Man. That, that shit used to piss me the pure. fuck up. Man, she used to piss right, on the right. Room. But happy as hell. But think about this next question. How do you put your girl up on that type of game? Because he's being nice. They know. He, I, I sometimes I think they, they do, know. but from the start, that well, ain't the yeah, type of game know. you gotta put your yeah. girl up on. She know. No, but think about how many. I mean, I'm, I'm asking y'all. Basic, because to, to to us that's basic game. But how many times have you felt the need to tell your girl about basic game? I mean, they know already. It, yeah. Because you know, like, the simple fact is. And <laughs> some people will look at me straight and messed up when I say this. You know, women love attention. Yeah. They love attention. They so they look at you strange at all. Yeah, yeah. They, no, they, no, they, no, 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 you know what I mean. Out yeah. there, if a woman is hearing this, she gonna look like she knows that she does. Yeah. But you let a man they tell act you like that they don't. exactly. Yeah, I'm gonna tell you how crazy women are. I think they do that shit to get attention from you. I do too. I want you. I want you to say. Who the fuck is this nigga? You know what I'm saying? Put because this shit on your wall. Don't. If you don't. <laughs> really? Right. Exactly. Yeah. You don't yeah. care. You know, you didn't care. Mm-hmm. Yep. You, know you see, I, mean? I got potentials, man. Right, like, nigga, I you got better. potential. Yeah. I, I've always uh, thought that, too. Fuck I've always man. thought they that. They all eating Chinese food with one chopstick. They all fucking crazy. <laughs> but they yeah. can still get full, though. But one question with that is, do you call that sometimes borderline yeah. insecurity or... You know I what? I mean, it, but that's what I'm saying. Yeah. It, it, it depends on how far you go along with it. Is that borderline insecurity or it, 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 it is it can just be you just want attention? It, it can be, but when you say that females want and need attention, well, is we, it, know, is we, it, we know yeah. they want and need it. So is it borderline insecurity or more so of what they need? You kind of get what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, I hear it's you. tricky. It's tricky. Mm-hmm. It's tricky. And I don't even think it's a generational thing, but I'm going to ask no. Youngin. No. <laughs> is, it, is it a generational thing when it comes to the putting your woman up on, on let's just say, simple game? No. Not game, just simple game. No, I, I don't think it's a generational thing because, like I said, even in our generation, they know. You know, you know what I'm saying? Like, like that's that simple game, they know. You right. Know, it, it be a matter of seeking attention. And then uh, when, when y'all... When young sir brought it up about you know women needing that attention, I think there's always a certain point in a relationship where a woman and man feels the need to find out if they still got it. got it from they mate or from to society. Just from society, right. okay. You know what I'm saying? There, there's always a point in a relationship where a man or a woman want to know if they still got it. I think women, it usually happens in the relationship. You know, like women seek it. For men, we kind of stumble upon it. <laughs> yeah. You know, be, because, you know, if we if we just out with the guys and, and, and you know, just one shorty at the bar want to holler, I'm like, damn, I still got it. Yeah. You know, women, they, oh, I'm so sad. Like, 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 they like, fish. Like, 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 yeah, they, they fish. Fishing, you know, but y'all could be cuddled up watching a movie on Netflix right now. <laughs> you know, I'm like, okay. That's kind of that yeah, that's kind of yeah, that's kind of deep. You know, so. It, it, but you know what? That brings up a good point, though. Like you said, one female at the bar can make us feel good. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But a female need about ten to fifteen to get that same, you know, what I'm saying that same feeling. Or maybe, uh, maybe that's the reverse that we have. That's when quality. Us and quantity, and quantity yeah. for them, yeah, yeah. coming to, come to factor. Yeah, because because dudes will shoot down an ugly chick so quick. Yeah. 
<laughs> you better get away from my car. I start throwing rocks. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we'll shoot it now so quick. Yeah. Now, staying on subject, as far as men and women being friends, I know y'all probably heard the same, like I've heard all my life, you know, all men are dogs. All men only want one thing. With that being the rage since birth, how do females enjoy the compliments or the thirsty from the guys? Mm. You know what I'm saying? See, that's where I get confused. If they understand all they want is... Yeah, if, if you're saying all guys is on this and they just dogs and they just want to fuck, they're trying to get in your pants, how do you... How do you enjoy the flirting and the comments from the guy? Well, how can you take him seriously? Yeah. How can you take yeah, him how, seriously? Yeah, how, you know? Oh, shit. That's a good question. That's I need a real good to that. question. I ain't got yeah, that's not, but you understand how y'all confused? I'm confused on that. You know what I'm saying? I, I wish we had a woman to answer that. I just say what I always say, because they crazy. Yeah. I just go all we go with Because from a gas standpoint, you know, my, my when you originally brought it, I I wanted to say, well, you know, they just gotta, you know, based on how they present it, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. the compliment, yeah, you know, be it. it's how they take, you know, everybody, you know, you got some dudes that's just straight out, oh, you bad, you this, you this, right. yeah, but you know, but so then you got some guys that are cleaning up, they like, like the sweet talk, yeah, they like that sweet talk, Mother you know, Earth, like, oh, Queen yeah. Goddess, yeah, yeah. like, oh, okay, you know, yeah, yeah but at the same like the time, but they still say he just want one thing, you know, what right. I mean, they, you know, they they'll say that in a heartbeat, but. It's kind of like, how do you enjoy the compliment, or how how do you accept the compliment if you're saying all guys is on one thing? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, I, I don't even know. It's kind of like if if you have daughters, and you're trying to put your daughter up on game, you're gonna tell her all this. Mm -hmm. All men want one thing. We gonna say, do, lie, cheat, and steal. Yeah. Now your yeah, daughter gonna sit there and say, it ain't that serious. What I got ain't that serious, Dad. But we telling them. Well, no, sweetheart. Uh, well, maybe, <laughs> well, well, maybe because we all sitting there stump because we can't answer that shit. <laughs> it could be, it could be like like Youngin was saying. You know, at the end of the day, she knows, she knows that she knows that that's all they want. But uh -huh. it is how they present it. Yeah. You know what I mean. I, so I, I was, it's how you present it to me. Right. You know the presentation of it. Yeah, I know you wanna. Yeah, I know at the end of the day you wanna get in my pants. But so make the lie look good. Basically, be nice about it. Make it look good, you know. Decorate so, the life. So I guess if enough enough dudes come to her in that way, she's feeling good. Which kind of what you said brought a question to to mind. I, I don't want to get too off topic. Should women appreciate lies? I've always yes. said yes. Yes. Yeah. yes. I've always yeah. said yes. 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 I've yeah. always said yes because. Man, I'm probably sitting with one, two, three, four, including myself, five assholes. And when you get certain questions from certain people, your asshole either gonna click in or click oh, off. Right. And appreciate uh -huh. that I had to go I had to mentally prepare myself to not be an asshole when <laughs> yes. you going to be an asshole. So that's right. love that I'm right. actually showing. That really yeah, that really is. That's some beautiful shit. And we ain't talking that's about how the, I show my love. We ain't <laughs> I my love. But I'm not being an asshole. You're like, damn, he's showing his love right Cause now. Because we ain't talking about the basic, the whole, do I look fat in this. That's no. basic. No, no, we talking about, yeah, we we, no. we we talking about the whole, you know, bang, I'm not feeling good. <laughs> don't ask me that. My job getting on my nerves. You know, whatever it is, when they really deep, you know, bring that deep convo. And we talk to them. And we really give them that real. Because we can easily lie and make it sound so sweet, like, it ain't your fault. It's not your fault. Your job is tripping. We, or we can say, well, did you do this? Did you do that? You know what? Maybe if you'd have done this, that. Because sometimes when you get into a fight with your girl, My it's because. I hate that. I know, but think about it. You do it because she's your woman. Think and about I, it. I true. do it all the time. But, always yeah. But you keep it 100. But you know, in that situation, I think. A lot of people like she came home talking about her job. Mm -hmm. I'm not even too sure if she's looking for you to respond. I've learned that. Yeah, they I not. She they just talking. She really women. having a conversation yeah, by herself. And, 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 and I've never, women. I've never understood that. Women do that a lot. You have to learn. Women, that. women, women, yeah, women yeah, do that a lot. Because because a lot. Like, yeah, I, I just naturally feel like you want to fix the problem. Right. That's what you do. And she like you know. You know. 
Because yeah, you whatever know. response you getting, it's I gone. think she's probably mentally in her head saying she's thinking you saying, "Damn, this dumb bitch couldn't figure this shit out alone." Yeah. She's like, but y'all really she, just told me something, right? Yeah, 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 for real. I mean, it it took me a while. <laughs> I knew that. It took me a while. And now here's the now here's the hard thing for me. It took for her to come to me about that shit and me at me knowing it, me actually continuing to pay attention to what the fuck she's saying. Because she'd get to talking about blah, blah, blah. And I'm thinking and about something. Ask you a question. And then actually ask I'd be like, oh, fuck. What's I'm caught. What'd she say? Yeah. Right. You know, and I'd just be like, man, Rochelle did what? See, now, any, anytime I ever lose focus, I pick on key words that I remember. Job, bogus, yeah. me. I was like, yeah, he shouldn't have did that hurt. Or, or you just go back or you just go back and say, so that motherfucker did this, right? Let me get this right. Because y'all put that, let me get this yeah, right. So, wait, wait, I want to so, make sure I heard it right. So what did he say? Right. And then she'd right. be like, okay. he interested, well, you know, he didn't give me an answer. And then just shake your head like, mm. yeah, I'm, 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 like I'm going to yeah, yeah, get y'all the gym. Okay. When you do get stuck and caught, this is what you say. You just say, hold on. Why do you put up with it? You know, and, and again, it's not that you got lost, like you weren't paying attention. It was just so many words at one time. Right. And the game on, or you know, something. You got so much on your mind. I'm just saying, just say, why do you put up with it? You know what I'm saying? And they will start back over and you can catch back up. I don't, I, I don't even think they um, be really having an the issue. They just want to talk. Yeah, that's all I, it really is. Oh, oh, these off. Oh no, man, crazy. See, but, but, <laughs> that's all I can keep saying. You said crazy really because certain questions that men really don't care about, women ask. Like the the one, how was your day? That question. Yeah, men generally don't give a fuck how your day was. And you gotta no, say it. Sometimes you do. No, no, no. I mean, no. I mean, no. well, me, no. well, me. Sometimes I do. I'm neutral on this one. Sometimes I do. Sometimes it's been times my girl come home with just. You know when they come in and you know their attitude fucked up yeah. and you know you didn't do nothing this time. Oh, you think you didn't do nothing? Right, exactly. You, you <laughs> feel see, like, see, but you, you have 100%. to ask that question. Did you really care how her day was? But, but you the, only asked that question. Right. Did you really? Right. You felt like right. you see. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So right. it's like, so, exactly. so you really, you like, right. you really didn't care. Yeah, I really didn't care. Right. 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 You in that situation, yeah. like, this okay. one was the same. How was your damn day? Well, at the same time, do you think they really care about our day? I don't think they do. Uh, no, that thing is being really no. no. They just really want to know if you ran into a new bitch today. Basically. Uh, so, what did bitch run into today? Room. None. Oh, okay. That's just a conversational oh, piece. Yeah, you know, yeah. So, what happened to you today? Yeah. Hey, you know, you just a conversation piece. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But you know what the fuck you up, though? When you do come home vending about work and they pay attention and you start realizing they, they know coworkers' names, yeah. like, oh, shit. Because you can't do the same. Yeah, I can't do no shit. But you know what? I'll take that back. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna say this. The reason why we can't remember coworkers' names is because they don't give us names. They say that bitch, or that heifer, or the girl I told you that don't like. You know, they you, women don't give you names. They don't. Yeah. And, and they not don't. and not to mention sometimes your girl come to you and she's saying that shit and you be like. But damn, baby, you was wrong in my in my head. Ooh, I yeah. yeah. <laughs> You're like you the one that fucked up. If you want to know the truth, I learned don't ever. Yeah, don't ever. That's one thing I <laughs> I know for a fact. Don't ever because yeah. I've been in a situation that. like that and she was wrong. Right, that's when that truth come. Out. You just yeah, be like, that, that, it's, but it's you sitting yourself through that, that shit. Like you the one. Yeah. You, you the nigga, up. bite your tongue to blood come out <laughs> for real. You the fuck <laughs> up. I, I have to <laughs> for real. <laughs> This shit done went left on me so many times. Now, I'm like, man, I'm trying to help you out. Now, let me ask y'all this. Okay, say, for example, you got, you know, your girl come home from work. She like, okay, babe, you know, this this happened. This manager gonna tell me sweep the motherfucking floor. That ain't my job. I ain't had to sweep the floor. And you thinking to yourself, well, babe, why you just didn't sweep the floor? But Would you say, say that? Now, the younger nah. me would. The older me nah. wouldn't. See, yeah, the younger me nah. would have been like, okay, well, if yeah. she asked you... Sweet the floor. You know what's wrong yeah, with sweeping you know. the motherfucking floor. Yeah, the younger me would say, what's wrong with sweeping the floor? What's wrong with you? But see, it's deeper than just sweeping the floor. Right. That's what I learned as I got older. Yeah, they never... You know. <laughs> right. I say shit like, you know what, babe? We're going to start our own shit. Fuck that yeah, floor. Yeah, they just... Right, they just fucking <laughs> with you, man. We out I say that go. now. Back in the day, motherfucker... Sweep the damn floor. And then, <laughs> and then you get that. Sweep what you floor. jumping on they side and right. all this other yep. stuff, and then yep. you look like oh, I just passed the car. Hate that. Man, I just always say you get hate that. Yeah. It's called it's called living and learning, man. It's yeah. called living and learning. Man, y'all teaching me some shit. Yeah. Oh, it's hard too. It's hard though because like I. 
I didn't, I didn't oh, realize yeah. I was like maybe 31 so, or 32. So as soon as I walked in the door, baby, how was your day? It's like 2 in the morning. <laughs> you know, I, I learned this oh, around. Oh, but you still care. <laughs> I learned this around. <laughs> <laughs> That's you the one I come, on, you, you come on in here with me right now. <laughs> right. You care. You I, I, I think I learned this around 31, 32 that some people, majority women, they just like to vent. Yeah, I yeah, didn't really true. realize that. I always thought if you would come to me with something like Young and said, you asking my opinion on it. And to but help some you. people don't want that. They're yeah, just, they're and just, I just yeah. when she's coming, she's talking about the day at work. I really just take it she's venting. But it, yeah. it's hard for me because I I feel dumbfounded in that situation because because you're I, trying to fix the problem. I, but not even that. Sometimes I actually listen. And I feel like it garners some type of response. Oh, that's your first mistake. <laughs> actually listening? Yeah, because see, you, yeah. cause when you actually listen, you're, you're, you're waiting to hear, oh, I can fix that. Yeah. Right. I can, it's like when somebody's trying to explain to you, you know, you call, what the fuck, the, the helpline, yeah. the Comcast fuck up, and uh -huh. they telling you, you paying attention to that Arab that can't really talk because you're trying to pick up on what they're saying. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's where you mess up. And yeah. A lot of times with women, just let them, you know. Let, let them vent. Yeah, yeah, just let them vent. Yeah. yeah, just let them. So, 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 they, so, they what, so what like should my res response be at the, at the end of that, though? Nothing. No, you know what? Sometimes you say, baby, come here. Get, right. Let me give you a hug. You had a fucked up. You didn't have to do it. Don't, don't even that. say it. Just do it. Yeah. Don't say nothing. Just, just give a hug. Yeah, just walk up and say, come here. Come here. For real. Because she want to know you on her side. Right. Pretty much, yeah. And then she do it, say, wow. As you open your hand up, she comes in like wow. That's a, and, that, and that's a good. I always use wow when I'm talking. <laughs> wow. I promise you. And you know this, young. I always use wow with a, with somebody yeah. talking, and I'm not really listening, but I should have been listening. I'd be like, wow, that's crazy. And then and then throw in a. I and thought my dad said that shit to me. I was like, you better watch out for that. Yeah, like you better watch out for that one. You. <laughs> And ladies, we're not saying this to say that we don't really listen or appreciate what you're saying and we just brushing you off. That's not it. It's just a man's brain is different. Like, y'all brain is different. A man's brain is different. We want you to know we got you. But, right. no, we didn't really pay attention to every single detail. Wow. Compared, 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 look, compared to when... We try to explain to you about a motherfucker taking a dumbass shot in basketball. Thank you. A passing the Thank dumbass you. in football. Talk about, why the fuck would he pass it to him when he was open? And you sitting there like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. 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 Take, take it's, it the same, it's, the same, it's the same way. You know. We're not going to come back and quiz your ass in the game. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But you ask why I'm mad, this is why I'm mad. Like you said, he took a dumbass shot. <laughs> the coach drew up a dumbass play. And y'all still try to sit there and try to figure out, well, why you upset? You don't play for the team. Yeah. That's kind of how we look at the whole, yeah. you know, the girl at your job that do dumb shit. You know. Yeah. See that was see y'all learned something today on Diesel know. Radio. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But y'all yeah, truly just taught me something. <laughs> let me let me for. let me flip it a little bit. Let's say your female got that friend, a, a female friend. And she's the single. We ain't even gonna say single. I don't, I don't know how to categorize this friend. Let's just, when when I talk about the friend, y'all gonna recognize the friend. Okay, okay. But you know, she called to come hang out. Right. And she's always negative. I mean, always negative. You right? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, now I know that bitch. <laughs> the single one. Now sometimes they got somebody. They got a couple. Oh, but now your friend, I mean your your girl comes to you to tell you about the friend. How much attention do you pay? None. I don't pay none because none it don't matter what she say, I'm gonna say you won't need to be fucking with her ass anyway. Cause she negative. Because, you know, at the it because that's her friend and I get it, but at the end of the day, Ain't nothing you can say Cause If you come to me Complaining about her And I'm already thinking She's a negative motherfucker I don't even want to hear What you got to say Cause it's, I ain't gonna do nothing To prove my point See I, I already got a phrase for, for, the, for the friend I just say Oh damn that's fucked up Right Yeah I say I, that I, now I, I, I just say Oh that, damn that's that, fucked that, up That one I do know but yeah. you saying if the, you saying if you already know that that friend is negative, right? Yeah, she's just yeah. a negative person. Yeah, and then your lady come to you and she see your like, lady don't see it though. Your lady see her as oh, this is my friend, right? 
But you you didn't put two or two together. Uh, Every no. time yeah. this friend come around. That's that's what that put you know, you gotta put up on game and let her know. Have you noticed this? Every time this happened, your friend No, I don't do that. But still I, that's this shit. I mean that's shit. It's gonna be like that's I mean, That's your lady, whether she you know, whether she wanna hear it or not, that's what you I mean want true, but it's kinda of that but friend. But in the end, still that friend. friend. Yeah, yeah she's still that friend. Right. Yeah, that on on that you know the the situation as far as that friendship is concerned. Oh, how much input you really got. But you know, that's what that's like what I said earlier. Once I tell you about your friend, you have knowledge about your friend. You're responsible if yeah, you but fuck with You know, you can do that so and now, still be friends with well, I mean, that's on you. Don't yeah, come to me exactly. again that's what with I'm some negative like, shit. But you, know, but you know, nine times out of ten, if she come to you like that, it's one of them friends which she's had for a long time. She yep. doesn't do that with Right. Uh, not, not, not the somebody, randoms. Right. Exactly. The randoms don't get so that treatment. it's one of those, you already know, it, it's pretty much like this bitch ain't going nowhere. Not she never. Be that, that's where that one-time conversation come in at. And that's why I asked. That's why I asked. One time conversation. But you want to know something you do? Uh, But like I said, if it's that long time friend, she already knows. She know. Mm -hmm. She might might come to you and act like she don't know, but she know. Don't. I'm but like talking. I said, she just you wants know? to talk. Like, exactly. Yeah, she, she just right. wants to talk. Yeah. She don't know. talking to me Believe about your me. friend, and that's gonna make me not like your friend when she around. But even but as, as a guy, you don't make her But as a guy, But as a guy, do that shit irritate you if she's yes, constantly coming yeah. to you about that yeah, shit but, and you didn't already told? Yeah, but this one of them, you gotta already have yeah. it in your mind she's yeah. not going anywhere yeah. and that's why i brought it up because it's one of those she's like not. it's a different situation than the work because this friend they got history they right. probably got more years exactly. than y'all got right exactly you it's, know? A, it's, a, it's a good chance that you'll be gone before she be gone <laughs> if you really want to know the truth the type of yeah. stuff you don't even get involved with mm-hmm. yeah. I'll, t- I'll always let yeah. my ladies know if you got a friend that's been here before me whatever the situation is I don't want no involvement that's between well, you well I, 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 I can't I can't do that one you can listen but yeah. I mean it's you like can, that's all you can do it, exactly that's what like I was just about listen. to say you can listen and just tread through the, yeah. tread through the that, shit like nothing more you can do no nah, but sometimes they may be fucking your girl up yeah. You yeah. gotta you gotta put them up on hey, hold on. She said what? You you you, you can do what and make how much? You know what I'm saying? Oh, uh-huh. hell. You gotta I mean, stop that. I mean, let's be realistic. You you, you yeah, don't right, right. Let's step be in realistic. and be like, hey, wait the fuck a minute. Yeah, that's but what I'm saying. It, but it's still one of those you just have to be real, realistic about it, no. This bitch ain't going nowhere. It's yeah, like I mean that's true too. That's <laughs> like some shit you might be like, man, ex this bitch, leave up, but you gotta be like Right. You just gotta you, you gotta hold it. Yeah. Now now she trying to fuck up your shit and everything else, then you get into it like, hey, you know this bitch, she a lonely bitch, she this, she that, you know, let it be known. Let me ask you another question. But then question. she gonna pull that. Don't talk about my friend card. Let me ask you, me ask you another question. Then that, but, but then that's when you get really into it like right. who you fucking? <laughs> you fucking hot? Are you fucking me? I mean, let's 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 stop this right here now. Then yeah. you know she fuck around, and say Dexter. Then we all then you got a problem. Then you know, hey, let me ask y'all another question on the same scenario and topic. She got the friend, the female friend. Now the female friend is going through issues with her guy. Have you ever caught yourself just being real from a guy's point of view? Like, you got a female, you know, your female comes in, well, he said A, B, and C, and you hear the bullshit. Yeah. You hear the bullshit. Do you think it's a breaking of the man code to yes, tell the real going on? Is. Yes, it is. Yep. But do you consider the relationship of the friend and your girl before you think it's a breaking of the man code? Oh, I hear what you're saying. See, see, see no, you, you didn't, you didn't stun me. My thing is, <laughs> when, when, when it comes to man code, I think that shit applies to your guys. Fuck that other nigga. Really? I, I honestly do. Pretty much, yeah. I, I think yeah. that man code. That's what like, it is. Like, like man code applies mm, to these make niggas. That's the whole purpose of them. Make you you so, so, so basically, it. you was shit. Like if you was coming at a chick, you was shit on her guy to get some ass. Yeah. Oh wait, wait a minute. That's a, oh. that's a different. Oh. Now I was with you on the first part of the man code, but the oh, second no. part is 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 great. What's gonna stop that nigga to do the same shit to me? You I mean, me? but 
it, it's still, it, it's, that, it's that, still. That's how sad niggas get, get in the game, we man. Call, look, in nah. all actuality. Really? You want to nah. keep, uh, keep it 100? I yeah. mean, I wouldn't. I wouldn't make niggas into a you know. No, no, no. I ain't gonna. I ain't gonna tell the nigga over. down. I ain't gonna tell the nigga down. But I, 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 I just keep it general. I just keep it general. I mean, yeah. I've dealt with women and they'll come to me about a dude, and I'm just like you know about they guy or whatnot. I've never shitted on a dude. I just no, can't no, do no, it. No, no, no. I, I give. I, you, I but general, you never ask that with question. Him? Well, well, why you fucking with him? No, no, never? no, no. I look at it as though know. it 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 depends on how harsh or what it is because it's like one of those you 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 hate to give away some shit in which when it comes down to a man it affects all men like that's a major shit if it's like some a li some little shit part of the game yeah okay you can give away that but if it's like okay you see the like it's almost like the cheese like 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 if a situation came up and she said something about you know. He took my money, or you know, he did this. He 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 stole money. Whatever it is, something like that. I'd be like, wow, that's fucked up. Right. But to say, oh, he ain't shit. He a no. I can't oh, I do that. I see what you're saying. I can't right, do right. it. Now I can yeah. give you some general shit and be like, wow, that's right. fucked right. up. The little shit. Right. That. Right. But right. as far as shitting on him, I can't do it. But if he ain't shit. I mean, I ain't gonna say it. Right. I she gotta say you that's some shit have to lie. See, 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 but here's here's my thing. Here's my thing with that. I can do that because at the end of the day, she's gonna fall for that bullshit anyway. Alright. Not with my help. Yeah, I mean, exactly. Uh, that's that's how I look at it. Here's my thing. I'm not really going out there to help. You know, I'm not really going out of my way. I'm gonna tell you one thing. Like, yeah, the, you know, the nigga doing this. I then he ain't shit. You need to stop fucking. And I nah, agree I with him on that because, like, like, like you said, like you said, after I've told you, at that point, it's on you. Exactly. Hmm. You not, I don't not somebody that I'm you. trying to fuck with though. That's something totally different. I said once I told you, that's on you. That was that was right. on my lady. Now right. you talking about somebody I'm trying to do, trying to fuck with, and she got a nigga. I'm, I'm not, not shitting no, on her I'm, nigga. No, I'm not doing that. Yeah, I, I, I see I'm, what I'm, you're I'm doing. If you said her nigga ain't shit, you shitting on him. Yeah, you did start. That, that, that's when I lost you. You, you were saying on. the man rules on me. Man laws only apply to the niggas that just take. Right, you, right. Can, you can sit there and you say you, you can sit there. Only the niggas that you cool with. Period. No, like, man law applies to everybody. Everybody, right? Yeah. So it's, you, not, it's not your nigga so, law. So, it's so, man law. No, no, no. Yeah. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Man. Let me get this straight. So you saying I go in saying, oh, that nigga ain't shit. I know. I'm saying any, any, any I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna give you an example. Yeah, yeah. Give us an example. Give us an example. You trying to holler at it? You trying to holler at the female? Okay. Y'all talking for a minute? Right. She tell you some shit like, yeah, you know, my my guy say he can't come through because his calibrator and 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 his car broke and it's gonna be down for two weeks. You know he bullshitting. Do you say this nigga full of oh, no, shit? I ain't gonna say that. Nah, right. Yeah, that's what we Cause say. I'm all, at that point, I'm already in a dope. But no, but that's what we saying though. You not? Did she even told no. you that information alone? You yeah. already in a dope. That's what I'm saying. So we, we but, but I'm saying I know oh, guys to be no, like no, no. his 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 calibrator. Uh, no, first off, no. that shit don't exist. Right. Second off, it won't be down for two weeks. You know what I'm saying? Guys will do that. Right, 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 right. No, no. You might have to do it later. I thought y'all went on that. No, we ain't doing none of that. Hell no. I be thinking in my head when I hear shit like that. That's a good one. I should have used that. Word. Yeah, I, I, a simple, a simple. Oh, but, okay, uh, we but, get out but of here. You know, when when we go back to the, to the scenario we talked about with you know your right. girl and her friend, man, mm -hmm. and that shit. You know, I'm gonna be like, yeah, that's you know some bullshit. You know, the nigga ain't shit. No, but but in that scenario, no, right. man, right. that's what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah that, that that's what I'm saying. But uh, you know. Yeah, you, you don't do that type of shit. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it, it, it gets some, done. some guys yeah. that do it, right? <laughs> it, 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 it's some it gets guys, done. Because they game is... Yeah, they do. And that's a nigga that ain't got no game. Like, let me right. see like this. Let me, let me give you a real quick story. I got a buddy, right? Uh -huh. I was at the spot with him. And we sitting there chilling. Whatever, we kicking it. And this dude walked past, and we look at him. And my buddy, like, man, I know this cat from somewhere. Because mm -hmm. it was like a group of females, and one female walked past us, and she went, he's a crowded club or whatnot, and she walked past, and everybody's like, damn, whatever. She come back with the dude. And we're like, man, we know this dude. Come to find out, 
It was my guy sister's boyfriend. Oh. So he was like, whoa, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But my man was like this. He said, what's up, bro? You know what I'm saying? And, of course, the boyfriend was like, oh, shit. You know, yeah. he had this big right. ass like, oh, man, it ain't even what you want, blah, blah, blah. And the dude was like, and my guy was like, fam, you straight. You straight. You know, he like, you cool. You know what I'm saying? Go do your thing. You cool. Yeah. I'm just letting you know he cool. So, basically, long story short, my man went over there. You know what I'm saying? Well, the sister boyfriend, he went over there. Did his thing, you know what I'm saying? He wasn't on the short, he did what, and the motherfucker walked out like five, ten minutes later. <laughs> man, to play about a dub to get in, right? He said, All right, I'm out of here. And my man was like, Dude, you good? He was like, Nah, man, ain't he like that boy <laughs> right? back? So he walked out, and my man never told his sister. And I was just like, And now my thing was, Ooh, I'm touching your mouth. But, but yeah, here's the thing, but here's the thing, though. Cause I'm like, man, I ain't really get it. But my man was like, hey, he was like, hey, he didn't do nothing in front of me. Mm. Yeah, you know see, what I'm yeah, I agree with and that. And I also, he said, how do I know my sister ain't piss him off and say some shit that she doesn't have to say? Oh, yeah, that, that's true too. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that's so, true. So, no, I'm saying that that, that you know, that all plays thing, a part just like, mind. hey, it is yeah. what it is. All you know right. what I'm saying? I can't say I he did nothing wrong. Right. I can't say he did nothing wrong. He said, I understood. My man got up and left. And you know what? Really, and that was that. Did you say the guy that left? I got to get him props because yeah. now you didn't put me in a fucked up situation. Right, right. Because you see what I'm saying? Because you. Yeah. Right. Reason why he left? Because he know? probably put me in a fucked up situation. Right, right. You know. So you got to respect that. And he ain't yeah, thinking that you know guy saying? called you like I'm not gonna get right. him right. this. Right. Like, don't yeah, don't me don't, this. don't do it in my face. Like, mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I, yeah, I know you said it's cool, but don't do it in my face. Right. Yeah, that I yeah. 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 I got to honor that one. So, I mean, that's my why. My sister I, and you out here, you know what I'm saying, all in the bitch ear, that's kissing what I'm on saying. the neck. Guy cold. I actually, it's guy cold. Because I remember as a shorty, I remember as a shorty, I'm walking down the street with my aunt, and this dude said, Dad, what's up, shorty, blah, blah, blah. And as a shorty, I'm like, man, talking to my aunt like this, man, what the f-? He looked at me and said, hey, man, when you get older, you going to be hollering at somebody, aunt? Said, somebody well, aunt, somebody mama, said, well, somebody damn, grandma. Okay, I guess you got a point. Proceed. <laughs> I, said, I guess you got a point. Say, man, you know you out of somebody's yeah. And after that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I understood it. I, I yeah. your aunties ever since. <laughs> <laughs> but that's what I was saying. You know that like what dude did was a little respectful. Hey, right. yeah. don't do. I'm, I'm here with my people. Don't if you're doing dirt, don't please don't put it in front of me. Because I'm pretty sure my man didn't know. He was in there. He just yeah, walked in like, yeah. oh, shit. Don't, so. don't do it in front of me because now you put me in a fucked up situation. I'm trying to be cool about it, but that's my sister. Because what if your sister is one of them, I love my man, keeping the house clean, making biscuits from scratch, nigga. And he doing that? From scratch. Exactly, from <laughs> scratch. You saying something. You know what I'm saying? When she in there talking about some, I'm not getting my hair done because his birthday coming up and he trying to get this new car and I'm trying to say every penny. You not finna <laughs> look at your sister and say you doing a good job. <laughs> you gonna yeah. stop something like he ain't worth it. Let me tell you why. I don't know if you I still don't say know. that. Because I, don't don't know. Know. I mean, maybe you want to say. Maybe you say I gotta go. I can't hear this. I gotta nah, go. Nah, because, nah. I don't know if you, you're gonna say it. You're gonna say it. You can't tell me you're not gonna. Oh, you're gonna no. say it. I don't know. Oh, and, and the no. reason and the reason why I say this is because by me being the man and and I'm gonna go somewhere where I really shouldn't even go with it. <laughs> well, don't go there, young sir. <laughs> no, 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 no. Stay I'm neutral. Saying, no, I'm, I'm saying this because even though as far as even when it comes down to my mom, and we love our moms. <laughs> right, you finna lie. No, you finna lie. No, 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 no listen. Go ahead, go ahead. Have, your mother said, it. Have, have your mother did a, a say something to you and you looked at her a little bit like, I mean, this just the man part of uh, you, and you be like, at a, as a man, and then you be like, almost like, oh, you know, you have, you don't have that relationship like she had with your father. Right. You be like, but I under, I do somewhat understand by me being a man, like, uh, man. Yeah, but I, this, but this mama though. I know it's mama, but she's still yeah. a woman though, man. She's Y'all still a woman. Like mama, no, 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 now you, now, you, now you asking with our shit. I'm not saying shit. I'm not saying shit. I'm not saying shit on her. I'm not saying like I'm not saying shit on her. But you you somewhat understand by you being a 
male. That's what I mean. I'm not shit on nobody. Cause I'm not that, that one. But that's what I'm. That's where I'm going with it. You but are you going to be quiet though? Okay. Uh, <laughs> that's, why, that's, that's, that's why I said. Though. Yep. That's why in the beginning, like I said, <laughs> it's touchy. <laughs> It really is. It's touchy. Okay, but but answer the question though, young sir. Your mama telling you how much she in love with this guy. She talking about putting him. You know what, baby? I'm finna put. Well, you gotta take it that far, right. man. Yeah, 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 you see how I look at him? He taking it far. I don't know what he's saying. I'm just saying. Hey, I'm just saying. 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 I'm just in the beginning, if they two weeks in and you found your man at the strip club, come on now, you cutting yeah, that off. Yeah. You cutting that off. Don't tell me y'all well, two not. Weeks, yeah, two weeks in, yeah. And I, that's, yeah. Right. Now, let's say two years in. He done took you fishing to some fucking, <laughs> fucking uh, sporting events. You know what I'm saying? Then, but then, but then. Oh, look, man. Don't tell you what the fuck I'm doing at the strip club. <laughs> we, talk about, we talk about our age now. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. And then, you know, I'm just saying, he, he's trying to bond with you in the two years. Y'all connected. Y'all cool. And then mama tell you, yeah, he put a ring on it. We gonna get married. He ain't got no money, so I'm paying for everything. And then you see that same motherfucker. You think that motherfucker, motherfucker to the oh. ain't that to the T? She paying for it. But I'm, I'm just saying because I'm it has to be to get rid of. I'm a, and you I'm, and, I'm, and you see this motherfucker out on a date. I'm setting that motherfucker up with another oh, with another oh, female. Man, man, man law ain't 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 man, ain't got look, shit to do with it. Come on now, man oh, law. All I'm gonna say to that is because I mean. I hope I ain't never in the fucking situation. <laughs> right. Because it's like, at the that end of the day, all. you know that she, she, at the end of the day, she still is a woman. And you know, Man. and you know, like, uh, I'm serious. He lying. Like, he lying. lying. No, like, no, like, no, baby no. Baby mama versus right. yeah. do it that <laughs> way. Damn. Baby, it, baby it, mama it, different, it, though. She I know you went hard. You, you, you dug deep in that one. I'm trying to show y'all. Man, law don't I guess, really matter I, when I guess, it comes to certain men. I guess, well, well, you know something, in a situation like that, I guess the best thing I can answer right now what I would do would be if I came to my man, my my mom's guy or not fiance oh you should went hard. <laughs> yeah, right, right, me. Right, he, oh my god, you just say for it. You said you just trying to put it, just make it hard. You know what I would do, hard, you know what I would do, right? you, know what I would do? No. you know what I would do. Oh yes you are. You know what I would no, do? I would probably I, I, what I would probably do would be I wouldn't trick on them. But I will if God worst case scenario, worst, worst case scenario, I go to right. like, I would, hey, you know, you either you tell her or I wouldn't. But I don't know if I just solely go to mom. But you just said either you tell her or I would. But so, I give the I, I'm right. not even sure. sure. I'm, that chance. I'm squinting on that one. I don't even know if yeah. I do that. But but if I, he don't tell, if he don't tell, or be, better yet, he tell her, baby, my car broke down See, in not, front of this uh, spot. And your son saw me. No, see now he, he lying on me. But I'm just saying he he's trying to cover his ass like all men do. You still gonna hold down me? Nah, but, nah. He, with one, he can't use me. Right. <laughs> but but <laughs> exactly. nah. I mean. Or, I mean, or, or she tell you, yeah, I talked to Khalifas. But and Khalifas, <laughs> but, but, you know, but you know something? I, damn his it, brother I think, had his car. But well, damn it, I think it's man law that I'm struggling trying to figure out what I would do with it. So damn it, I ain't really breaking man law that I told. So because I'm going through, I'm going through a lot. Just mm. saying, yeah, I guess I would. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You would. You know, that's what I'm saying. So it's like man law matters to a certain but point. But kind of, let me ask you, if if you know your pops was on some shit. Would you tell tell your moms? See how Tracy right. yeah, yeah, right. yeah. You yeah. would? You would? Ooh, I don't know about that, that one either. Right. Yeah. I can't say yeah. Again, again, no, again, no. again, I would tell if you know, not if Pop's been doing this for the past 15, 20 years, it's like, Mama, you gotta know. So no, I wouldn't say shit. But if Pops was on some old, you know, happy home, I didn't know Pops was tricking off. You know what I'm saying? And and then Pops got caught tricking off. Yeah, I don't think I ever told him. Ah, right, I don't know if I, I ever told him. And, and like I said, that fall down on the same rule. Like I just said, you know, like. But okay, you got me with the whole, you know. <laughs> you I fucked me up with that one. I don't like what, the fact you what, did it, but you fucked me up with that one. Like I said, well, not, no, no, and, because like I said, dude, you, it's one of those, you know. But it's like, 
man. But you, no. but you're not gonna be cool with your mom being the dummy. Cause the way we look at dumb females, is your you're mom, not gonna be cool with your, your mom, mom being the, the dumb female. Is your mom but, but, the well, dummy you don't know or your father just a player? Okay. No, I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm saying is, on the on, on the fiance or the, you know what I'm saying thing. You know what but I'm saying? I mean, oh, I mean, oh, well, I, like I said, if it's pops, it's I look at it different with pops. The other dude, and like I say, it's it's still. It, 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 it's just how <laughs> yeah, he fucked me up with that one. <laughs> no, it's because it, it's like, like I say, two if two weeks or whatever. All right, that, right. He, two he, weeks of cutting he, you he off. Get the, he, he get the business, right? But you've been there, you know. We we got a bond. It's like it's almost like a. Do you really know? She might know, and she she just going along with it. And I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm saying, but yeah. you you know, you found all that out. Then you find out she's still at home. Honor his dirty draws. You know what I'm saying? She's still his backbone because she feel her man is her man and her man only. See, I guess and you know this. Well, I, mean, I guess in a situation like that, I got the angel on the one side of me saying, man, that's your mom's. You need to tell her. But then I got the devil on the other side saying, man, yeah, maybe, maybe she ain't going to get none up the other night. <laughs> 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 but that's what I'm saying. No, I guess I got both. So I got to listen to which one I'm listening to. Like, dude, like, y'all just being real. I'm just being real. So, I mean, I mean, no, don't, don't, don't get me wrong. Like, I know personally, you know, I can say it. Um, you can give me fifty Bibles. I ain't never sold none of my guys out. I ain't never sold none of my guys' friends out because it wasn't nothing in it for me to sell them out. Right. And with that being said, that is the cardinal rule to man law. I agree with you on that. If it doesn't prevent your family and yourself from being hurt, nigga. You under that shit. Well, let me you die. Let, let me ask you this then: What if you had like a son and then you was, you know, the you was you fell in that situation? Then how would you feel if, if you went and told mom like, you know, what what you was doing? Well, first off, shit. I mean, he got to do what he got to do for his mom. You know what I'm saying? Second off, if I got caught by my son. Not really caught, but he just right, he, he, figured he, he, right, shit out. Right. For whatever reason. I mean, I mean, still, okay, still okay. though, I'm not good at what I do. Cause my <laughs> youngin, my youngin should never catch me up on my dirt. Man, you feel man. me? Think, I mean, think, just think what you just asked me. You asking me that I'm so fucked up <laughs> no, that, that my youngin called me. Okay. If my youngin no, called me, my wife and I hear what you saying. <laughs> But, but I, I'm right just, what I'm saying is like on the incident, like, okay, just not even you on the equation. Like, you know how people out here is having young kids or whatever, yeah. and, and still the, the guys who is a little bit older, and he might run into the stale spot where you at, and you be like, oh. Listen to Same what he just said. Why the fuck am I at the spot that my son to come to? Now, you apply. feel me? My game true. fucked up. My true. game fucked up. True. It's just like us. We 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 True. we've done yeah, that you know kicking it hanging it out. How many times your mama bumped into your ass at the same club? True. You feel me? So if I'm that fucking stupid, <laughs> shit. Think about oh, it. Motherfuckers who like that now. <laughs> yeah. But that's true. Yeah. I that, that's true. I mean hell. I just found out I got a fucking brother that was that's a year behind me. And I could have swore my mom, my, my pops was with my mom until I was like three or four. Yeah. I mean, I know the math, but I never tell my mom's man. I mean, I, I don't know if she know. That shit old, 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 done. Oh, but, right, but, but still, <laughs> I still never said she had to bring it to me. Like, 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 I mean, no bullshit. I got a brother. His birthday on the 17th of August. Mine on 31st of August. Same year. Same, same year. <laughs> same father. How that so shit now, right, so now I understand why mama didn't stay with him. You, <laughs> <Right. know? laughs> you see what I'm saying? So it's kind of like, damn. But again, if you get caught that fast, that easy, that simple. Yeah. You, was doing and you know what? I'm going to be real. That's where my man law lies. You got to be on your shit for me to back you the fuck up. Let's be real. I mean, if you a dumbass, I'm not backing you. I, I can't I back you up. But, but some people, yeah, they don't care, too. I yeah. mean, yeah. Right. so yeah. if they don't care, yeah. I'm not backing you. They don't care, so... Yeah. But, you ain't, but you ain't backing me for that don't no care. Right. They don't need, he don't need no backup. Right, because he, he don't fucking care. He's and then a goof. you got to let me know that if right. you use me, you use me. Right. Don't, tell me don't that. call me the day your wife catch you up. Right. Right. Saying I was with you Saturday. Don't do that, and it's Tuesday. You know what I'm saying? Don't do that. That is true. 
Man, we That's all off, I'm saying. We, we went off topic like a motherfucker. No, it was good shoes. It was kind of good shoes. Hey, hey, that's how you. That's how we do, man. You get off one topic, you be like, man, this is another good topic. We they never know what you're gonna Cause they learning. Listening to Steve right. Radio. They learning. They learning. Yeah, that shit was pretty deep. But yeah, they learning. And Damn, then, you fucked me up with the mom shit. Go ahead. Yeah, see, you see, you know why I'm though? still fucked up off the sad bitch shit. <laughs> <laughs> so you talking about that, yeah, that show, show, yeah. You talking about, about that show. Yeah. show. You should have been there. Yeah, that's another show. <laughs> hey, but look, we gonna have part four this, coming up. I don't see the sad this, bitch topic ever ending. This shit gonna be more than the Jason Manhattan's and yeah, shit. The Jason yeah. and the Nightmare on Elm Street. We gonna <laughs> top that shit. <laughs> All right, I got another one for you on the, you know, on the um, Friends being friends, sexual sex. Right. <laughs> Can you honestly say if you were, you know, let's say you got that money, you got that dope, you know, and you got to hire a nanny. Can you hire a sexy nope. nanny? D- 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 I'm not going to do that no. by myself. No, no, no. You no. and your girl. You and your girl, no. y'all married. Can you hire a sexy nanny? No. Nope. Yes. No. No. <laughs> no, but no. But is your, no, no, is your no. woman gonna allow you that? That's the question. Here's, here's, right here's my reason. Here's, here's, here's my reason for that. I have two daughters. Uh huh. I need to have a sexy nanny in the house for the simple fact that they're gonna model themselves after their mother. Oh, listen to him. Their nanny. <laughs> I love that. Hey, hey. I love that. that. They're going to carry their See, that's a real nigga shit. Way. Well, you know something. Well, topic. you know something. Well, you know something. If your lady, if the, that's a smooth shit to you. Yeah, that, 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 that was, was real slick. Lady, that was real slick. More power that to you. No real, I'm saying. I want that yeah. shit. Right. Hey, you know what I'm saying? That's, hey. like, that's like your girl coming to you saying, we have two sons, so I need Morris Chestnut <laughs> with right. his shirt off to be the nanny. Are you going? Why would Morris? <laughs> no, no, no. Are you no, going? You can afford. Y'all going. can afford it. Right. Are you got going? Got the money. Morris Chestnut agreed. Right. Are you, are you going? going? I'm a fan of female. Oh uh-huh. <laughs> no. <laughs> How many nigga nannies do you know? I'm not from. Oh, it's a bunch of them. It's a bunch of them. Oh, the job hey, pays. Hey, 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 you know? hey, the I job don't pays know. well. Right. Nigga, yeah, show yeah. me a nigga nanny right now. Oh, we, we, we ain't got no, you know, group. A nigga you know, nanny. Group. Find me a nigga nanny right now, and hey. yeah, I will agree to the shit. Go on we'll Craigslist. That nigga right. That nigga be just... <laughs> That nigga just like my man off when Martin had that episode when Zeus was on that one, Devo was on that one. I'm Apollo and get the running, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Nah, you ain't gonna working here. Yeah, that's that, that's kind of my point. You ain't gonna have no nah. no bowflex ass yeah, nigga in your career. Show, show me a nigga. Nanny. <laughs> he said, but you cool with the show me nigga, with the attractive nanny. nanny. I mean, that's worth a nigga shot. Nanny. If, if hey, if that works, the, the story, the line you gave, hey, if she bad, hey, more power to you. Then that's how I feel. I will live to tell your story. <laughs> <laughs> like, hey, I know this nigga that did this, man. Right. Like, hey, he got right. a fine nanny now because of it. You know what I'm saying? I would, saying? I would live to tell your story. So you ain't got to worry should, about we that We just shit. being real. You know what I mean? But, <laughs> yeah, that was some bullshit. Wait, did I break man law on that one? I said it was some bullshit. <laughs> shit don't mean nothing. Wait, did I? <laughs> no, you stopped him from making a fool walk. I know what I did. I think I broke man law. <laughs> Cause you know the problems coming with that, right? Yeah, you know what I'm saying. You don't want to do that one, man. You got this fine ass nanny from Hawaii. But you gonna fuck your nanny? <laughs> Hell yeah, you plenty of times. Plenty of times. Yeah, bro. First of all, the woman ain't gonna allow it to happen. She she you better not know that. That's not going to happen. She better not. For real. Mm-mm-mm-mm. Ooh hey, shit. Hey, she got one ounce of fat on her. She gonna be like, oh no, nah, this bitch ain't getting up in here. Like, uh uh-uh. uh, she, she know it's all in your mind. Late. Exactly. All right, let's do some pardon shots. And as always, I'm going to let everybody say what they got to say. And we started on same-sex friendship. <laughs> what? <laughs> that was the original time. Yeah, we started on same-sex friendship. So, Wait, same-sex? Oh, 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 oh you right. Oh, shit. Oh, yo, oh, oh, right. Right. Hey, name the drink. Name the drink. Right. Opposite sex okay. friendship. Oh, okay. Yeah. I want to ask all of y'all. Do you think that you and your lady can have same sex friends? Man, I, if I can have a fan opposite ass sex. nanny. Opposite oh, I'm sex. sorry, I'm sorry. If you and your lady can have opposite sex friends. Not, not, no, not, not, not the nanny, just not opposite nanny. sex friends. Just opposite sex friends, yeah. 
Why? <laughs> he's smiling and shit. Ain't he though? He's cheesing hard. Hell yeah. <laughs> I got planes. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I, I, I think so. You, you know what I'm saying? As, as long as long as you and your lady, you know, like my man, that nigga said, put each other up on game and know, know them lines. Because there's always a line drawn in the sand. You know, there's always the gun line. You cross that gun line, you know that shit. The gun line, boss. Mm, so. What you got, young sir? Is the dude gay? <laughs> <laughs> Because that's, a, that's the only way it's going to happen. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Truman is a dude gay. If he ain't gay, no. If he gay, yeah. Because they can go shopping and do other shit. I don't mean bye. I mean right. gay. Other than that, no. <laughs> because he's going to be trying to fuck her. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And then she's going to... I don't even care if she's not really intimidated. Depends on how the chick look. And she's my friend. I'm going to be catching heat from that. Mm. So, exactly. I ain't think about that with no. you. Exactly. No, it cannot happen. What you got, that nigga? Uh, like I was saying, you know, you just gotta put each other on game. Um, I think, I, I think, you know, you have to just look at the reality of it. You can't expect your lady to just deal, just talk to, you know, women, women, everywhere she goes. Right. And you can't expect your guy, ladies, you can't expect your guy to. You know, talk to guys every, you know, all the time. Um, only thing I would say to all our listeners, you know, if you're going to have a male, female, if a female, if a female is going to have a male friend, best friend, or whatever, and vice versa for the guys, I would say try to make sure you do not bring up your relationship, shit that goes on in your relationship, just trying to get advice. Because I think a lot of females and a lot of guys, they would say, Okay, my lady did this and they asked mm-hmm. for advice. And some people may have good instincts on what they're going to say to you, but you just got to be careful. So I, I honestly think you should just, it, you can keep the friends, but just keep them as that. Do not ask their opinions when it comes to relationships. Hey, that's because a, that, I, shit, yeah. that shit could backfire. And then one, the guy, especially from a guy's point of view, he knows what's going on in a relationship. And nine times out of ten, he's probably gonna just say something just to, you know, something that you want to hear. And he might try and fuck you. He is gonna try to fuck you. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> what you got, short? Sure? You know, with that, I'm gonna say for men, yes; for women, no. <laughs> I mean, you, y'all can hate me all y'all want. You know, follow me on underscore uh, short got him. That's G O T E M. But for men, yeah; for women, no. I, you know. I feel like this. If you got a history, I can understand. But it's debatable. Yeah, but if you have a current situation, nah. Ain't no new friends. Like what what <laughs> Drake? No right, new friends. No new friends. Yeah, no 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 new friends. Good point. That's on both sides too, male and female. No new friends. You know what I'm saying? Because you always hear that shit motherfucker say that. People like when you get into a relationship, that's when people try to fuck you up. So don't 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 make it that easy. Don't invite motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying, to fuck you up. You know? They go for young, old, I don't give a fuck, you know what I'm saying? Small, fat, thin. Don't bring in new motherfuckers to fuck y'all up. Cause you gotta understand, it's y'all against them. And it's more them than it is y'all. That's true. What you got, short? You know, before we close out, I'm gonna ask y'all one last question on this topic. Go ahead. Would you say flirting is a form of cheating? It depends on now, be, flirting. Before everybody else get a response to me, I'm going to say yes. Be, only because if you're knowingly flirting with somebody, you're making yourself available to that person. So to no, me, that's cheating. No, that's not so. true. I think so. Because I flirt to get free wings. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. I mean, seriously, I flirt, you know. I, I look at it. It, it, it goes on. How deep or how hard you flirt? Yeah, you know you could you could just tell someone in a flirtful way. You know what I'm saying? You look good today. It's just the way that you say it. And then you got females like I've I've been accused of flirting because I said, "Oh come on now, nah, you you can't hook us up." And I've been told I was flirting. Right. Yeah. I didn't it, think it, it was that deep. Yeah, exactly. I'm just trying to hook us, us, us <laughs> up. You know what I'm saying? So. That's why I said it depends on the flirt. Yeah, how hard you go. Yeah, it depends on the flirt. 
Everybody good before we close this out? I, I just want to add, um, once again, it's, it's 2016. You know, we, we had the New Year's call in show and whatnot. For this year, I, I, I want us to get up there more. And by that, I mean, if, if y'all fans of Steez already Radio not only promote the show, but go on iTunes, leave a review, you know, make make some comments on on these websites yes. to, to get to get us up there, man. Because if y'all not liking it, if y'all not rating it, if y'all not leaving reviews, more people not going to hear about us, you know, and, and, and the more true. good reviews that we get from y'all, our listeners, the higher they going, everybody else going to push us. So, so we, we need y'all. You know, so so help Steve's already will be better than it was, you know, in 2015. Yeah, I don't so. think I don't think the fans and the listeners understand how much power yeah, they I, have. How, how much power they they y'all got. y'all we, really we, have. We're only going to go as far as y'all allow us to. So we we need y'all go please go on iTunes, SoundCloud, YouTube, hit them like buttons, hit them subscribe buttons. Leave comments, leave reviews, please, please, and thank y'all for everything that y'all done thus far. And stop being shy. I, I I love the inboxes, but stop being shy. If you have some that you feel strong about that we said you disagree with, come to our Facebook page, come to our Twitter account, come to our Instagram. Say what you got to say. We have some that they voice their opinion all the time, but I know it's more of y'all that don't agree. So please feel free. We we not gonna bash you. We, I no, mean, no. have you heard us bashing anybody? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, so bring it. We, we want you to bring it. A lot of times we say shit to piss you off. So stop acting like you ain't pissed off. Yeah. <laughs> and on that note, I'm going to go around again <laughs> <laughs> and say, what would you like to tell the fans? We heard from Youngin. You got some more Youngin? Yeah. Uh, follow us. At Steve's O Radio, Twitter, Instagram, once again, SoundCloud, iTunes, you can Google us, Steve's Radio. Call in, 708-880-0163. We want to hear from y'all, man. Thank you. What you got that nigga? Man, I just want, like, basically to piggyback on what Steve's O said, man, if you got questions, man, by all means, you know, we got call up, when we got the uh, call, call in shows, call. I'm sick. Well, I am sick of you motherfuckers calling and hanging up, man. Cause I know it ain't on our <laughs> ass, y'all. Is. You know, I know a couple of motherfuckers that called and said I, I got nervous and shit, which I'm like, really? <laughs> but you know what I'm saying? I, I, you know, I'm pretty sure y'all got questions or topics or whatnot. Cause you, you what is it about? What is it about? Five, six of us that's regularly yeah. here. Yeah, man, it's a million of you motherfuckers out there. So I know y'all got a million fucking questions. You yep. know what I'm saying? And as you know how we do it, we talk about it, and then that can lead up to something else, and you got more shows or whatnot. So, you know, like I said, don't don't hesitate to inbox these old radio. You know, hit them on iTunes. You know, everything the youngin said. And I just appreciate y'all. You know what I'm saying? Listening to us. Hope y'all enjoy. What you got, short sure, Gatham? Because I know you got some. Of them. Yeah, you know I'm gonna touch back on what uh, that nigga said though. If you are a little nervous when you call into the show remember you can call in anonymously you don't have to mention your real name you don't have mm-hmm. to mention your friend real name you can call in anonymously you know we, it, you don't have to get personal and put your whole life story out there or you can just don't get your real name if we figure it out <laughs> we figure it out if we don't we don't you know <laughs> yeah it's been times people called in and we still don't know who the fuck they are and then they yeah. tell us that so, was me <laughs> yeah. And spread the word too, man. Just spread the word man. too. I'm gonna leave, yeah. leave a couple of motherfucking flies and some sharks and shit over there about you know <laughs> the fucking car wash thing and shit. Club at Adriana's tonight or whatever. I'll leave them off of Steve's on radio watch. And on that note, we out. Well, but before we do go off Steezo, I just kind of wanted to you know. Get young sir, Steezo slow clap. This is first episode on. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 yeah. I think it's, it's, it's high time we start making our special guests feel a lot more special. Yeah, yeah. On, yeah. Right? We you ain't know? got no strippers, you yeah. know. But. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you guys, I do appreciate it. You know, anytime, anytime. There's no problem. All right, hey, don't just don't be a stranger. Oh shit, that was my head. Don't be a stranger. None of y'all. Stop being. I got to say this. I get inboxes after certain episodes. Okay. And the inboxes I get are 
I'm not gonna say mean, but they're kind of one-sided. They, I, I keep getting, you need women on there. You need women on there. We've brought women on the show. So what I would like is, before you inbox, I would like for you to listen to every episode. I've got inboxes saying, can you touch on interracial dating? We have. You just didn't hear it. I've got inboxes about, can you touch on cheating? And a lot of times we have. You just didn't hear it. You know, if you're new to the show and you just heard about three, understand we got, damn, well, 30, 31 episodes. Yeah, about 30 you know what I'm saying? So we've touched on a lot. You know, I got an inbox asking us, how come you all, being from Chicago, didn't talk about police killings <laughs> and police brutality? <laughs> like what, the third? Community, right, third the community. The community. You, you see what I'm saying? Episode, the 12th episode. The community would... We we ran through that. That's my you know what I'm saying? Episode. Yeah, so if you have more that you want to hear after you heard the community, that's different. But when you inbox us saying that we didn't touch on something, it's because maybe you haven't heard every episode. Yeah, and when do when when do we normally um just for the fans out there, when do we normally drop new episodes? We drop them Sunday night, Monday morning. Okay. Wednesday night, Friday night. So you there know, y'all go right there. Yeah. And Look again, on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Yeah, and just listen. And if we get the uh, the fans up, we can drop every day. But we need more fans. You know what I'm saying? Now the live shows, they vary, because I don't want to do a live show with just two people, and we don't want to do a live show with just two people. <laughs> live shows, you gotta stay in contact with us. We have too many outlets. We got SoundCloud. We got Facebook. ITunes. We got Instagram, we Twitter. got Twitter. You know iTunes. what I'm saying? We got iTunes, SoundCloud, all of it. Yeah. So your best bet is to follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. All if you want the X live show, Diesel Radio. Yeah. So if you want the live shows, or you keep inboxing me saying I wanted to call in, but I didn't know when. Some of y'all are lying right now because we've we've gotten so <laughs> much better with the Facebook, the iTunes, and the Instagram of telling you. Three to sometimes four days in advance when we're doing live call-in shows. So, we trying our best to keep y'all in tune. That's all we can do. And the phone lines are never busy. I may fuck up and forget to plug it in. <laughs> <laughs> but it still ain't busy. You know what I'm saying? And on that note, we are really, really, really out. Steve's thought of the day. All right, that was our take on can men and women be friends. You heard a lot of different things. You heard a lot, a lot of crazy things. I want to know what you think. If you think men and women can or can't be friends, hit us up at Steve's on Radio at Yahoo or at Steve's on Radio at Gmail. You can even hit us up on Twitter and Instagram with what you think about this topic and this subject. We'd love to hear from you.